Hi, this is Fainal Jabbar from Home Lectures. So today we will do a comparison between internet, intranet and extranet. After this. Yeah, before we discuss about internet, intranet and extranet, I think it will be better if we can discuss the definitions of network itself. So network is referred to the collections of computer or electronic devices that connected one to another. For example, let's say we do have few computers in our organization, computer A, B, C, and then we do have other devices such as uh, printer machines, we do have fax, we have scanner machines, and etc. So now back to our topic for today, internet, intranet, and extranet. I will make it very simple here. Number one, internet. Internet is referred to the worldwide connection. Remember the keyword is a worldwide connection means large, huge connection. For example, let's say we are from Malaysia, we want to send information to Uganda, Colombia, for example. So we are using internet from one building to another building, which is distant. Meanwhile, intranet is referred to the private network. Remember, intra means internal. So intranet means internal network managed by a specific organization. For example, Quest, we do have our own intranet. So basically, this intranet or private network can only access by specific stakeholder, especially internal stakeholder, for example, staff. Obviously, this intranet aims to increase the communication effectiveness within the organization. Meanwhile, extranet is a part of intranet itself. But you have to remember this, extranet is referred to the intranet which is we expand a bit the boundaries expand a bit the boundaries for example this is the size this is the boundaries for our intranet so we make it bigger by inviting other stakeholder for example our supplier the best example of extranet is supply change management where we need the supplier we will invite supplier to be part of our network yeah it's still private it can be accessed by everyone public for example it can only access by a specific group of people again just now for example supplier so hopefully this video help you to understand the concept of internet intranet and extranet if you need more explanations more example for this concept you can drop your comments you can drop your questions in the comment section below and yeah i will reply your question maybe in another video thank you for watching and remember guys subscribe 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 and see you guys again in the home lecture bye